What's going on guys gonna be playing some pokemon showdown today in the ou tier with a bunch of returning guys and guys that got some buffs with the release of the indigo disc dlc and the one i was most excited to use or one of them that i was very excited to use was rotom heat because rotom got back pain split and i think rotom heat really appreciates this because it can run leftover or not it doesn't have to run leftovers to have recovery it can run heavy duty boots which is really huge for it since it's weak to rocks and then it can have recovery with pain split so wanted to use Rotom Heat now that I got that back, but got three new guys that came out with the uh, DLC Superior, who hasn't been in uh, the main game or whatever since Gen 7, right? Then Tentacruel, uh, Classic Rapid Spinner, and then Latias, who got some new tools, but we're actually not using Draining Kiss on this set. We're gonna be using Terra Poison though, to hopefully help us to be, um, and, and set up on guys that could poison us and that would prevent us from sweeping. But let's just go over the rest of the team real quick and then we'll get into the games. Um, uh, this is more of like a balanced team and I think it's pretty decent. We built it on stream. Either way, it's been a lot of fun. So Latias is putting a lot of work and we have a choice band in Zamazenta and then that's been very good too. And then just kind of a standard Tinglu. But like I said, started with Rotom. I'm not sure if Fizz Def or Spit F is the best for Rotom Heat, but this one's Fizz Def because I think it works best on the, the team that I have. And I'm not sure if Thunder Wave or Will-O-Wisp would be better, but because it's a Fizz Def guy, we went with Will-O-Wisp. So you can burn and cripple physical attackers, but Thunder Wave would be nice, you know, because there's guys like Volcarona who could just come in on you otherwise, and getting a Thunder Wave off on them would be really nice. But, you know, burning physical attackers like King Gambit, Great Tusk. I haven't seen Great Tusk going Terra Fire, but um, Gouging Fire is another thing like Thunder Wave would be really nice for. But yeah, but we just got Volt Switch, Will-O-Wisp, uh, Overheat, and then Pain Split. Um, and Terra Steel to resist like Dragon or resist normal from maybe like Dragonite. Um, Dragonite's extreme speed could be nice. Maybe normal from like the uh, population bomb, tidy up guys, or Sencino that can do that now too. But so far it's been pretty nice. It's a it's a pivot too. Um, you can outspeed King Gambit pretty easily without much without much speed. So that's Rotom. Then we got Superior trying it out again. Um, I'm not sure if Terra Stellar or another Terra would be better, but I'm gonna try Terra Stellar again. Terra Blast doesn't become, you know, a, a coverage move that way. But then you do get the, uh, you have another way to boost. Um, and I believe it'll give you a little bit more power on your Terra Blast than Leaf Storm the first time you use it with uh, the Terra Stellar too. But I think it's decent. I don't know. I just haven't, I haven't gotten it to do like what I, I haven't gotten it to like sweep just because of having Terra Stellar. There's, I think there's been situations where like Terra Ground would be nice for like Heatrans or another, uh, Terra type would be nice for some sort of coverage. So, uh, but that's what I'm trying right for now. And then this is just the HP amount so that you can set up on Rotom Wash, I believe. Then we got Tentacruel who got Flip Turn. Uh, didn't have it last gen, even though Flip Turn was out in the game or was uh, was out last gen and Tentacruel was out last gen. I uh, didn't have it. So, um, and we're actually a fully like physical attacking Tentacruel. So instead of going like minus attack we're going minus attack since we have all physical moves anyways um you could go sludge bomb but poison jab could be kind of nice in a like i don't know keldeo volcarona stuff that boosts their special defense um that tentacle is kind of nice into enamorous could be decent to have the poison jab i don't know um i think that you could you could go either way but then we just have liquid ooze because it's on a rain team leftover so we have some sort of recovery and then Knock off to your bit of items, rapid spin, and sl uh, flip turn for the pivot. It's pretty nice. It's pretty standard tentacle. Um, but we have enough speed outspeed Excadrill, so you can pivot on Excadrill. You get it still out outspeed like Great Tusk too, and Glamora, and those things. And then Terra Grass, so we lose our ground weakness and keep our water resistance, I think. I don't know, this is the one I was seeing other people use. Then we got Latias with Terra Poison, like I already said, to, uh, so you can't be beaten by Toxic. But um, with Calm Mind, Sword Power, Recover, or Sphere, uh, you're pretty scary if you can get enough boosts. So I've seen people say like uh, Mental Herb could be nice, but also Covert Cloak could be decent. I'm just going with this for now. We do have Sub on Superiors, so that could be nice for Garganicals Covert, uh, kind of like a, you know, a way to deal with Garganicals thing without having a Covert Cloak. You can just sub up on them, but that's another option for Latias. But this has been pretty good. It's been pretty fun. Then we got Tinglu, just rocks with the Earthquake and Ruination and Whirlwind. It's been pretty nice to phase out opposing stored power guys. And then, of course, take on like 
special attacker since we technically can take a hit from like some things, but uh, Dragapults and Lotties and stuff like that. And then we have Choice Bane and Zamazenta just to get some like big damage and put pressure on. Um, I was thinking about going for attacks, heavy duty boots, but close combat uh, with the Choice Bane has been pretty, pretty good. So um, Hatterene's pretty scary for the team though. Uh, in one of the games testing, um, our Chaladon was a little annoying too. I think it was with this team, but not 100% sure. Either way, let's just get in the games real quick and hopefully we can get these first four to do something and uh, show off what the team can do. All right, cool. So I have Darkrai and Latios. So our Tingly will be very nice. Our Zamazenta will be pretty nice. The, the only thing is uh, Landorus that really wants to take it on. I think maybe we lead... I don't think we can Oko. Maybe we could Oko. Maybe we lead Zamazenta and just see see what happens. If they lead Landorus, we'll probably switch into Rotom. Yeah, can we just kill this? Zamazenta to Latios? Yeah, we're just gonna crunch. Maybe kill it. If they go Landorus, it is what it is, but this thing is super scary and... I mean, maybe they'd be Scarfed? I haven't seen Scarfed ones of this yet. Or we go Tinglu and that'd be a little safer. But if they go Landorus, then it'll be just a little annoying. And they do have Cinerase to get rid of our hazards too, so... I don't feel like trying to like prioritize them super heavily. Let's just go for crunch. Cool. Maybe that's not a defensive Landorus. All right, we go Rotom. Okay. And this is where Thunder Wave could be nice. Again, we could Thunder Wave this in a race, but I'll just will o -Wisp. Oh, nice, and we're faster. Sweet, this comes in. Could Terra and Will-O-Wisp or just go into something else? Oh, Tentacruel is actually pretty nice because they hurt themselves with the Liquid Ooze if they have, if they don't have Power or Whip, that is. Um, could Terra this and I think then we're like in a pretty decent spot, like everything's almost all just dealt with. I don't know. Might be a little bit of a rush to do that, but... All right, cool. Well, Rotom, uh, Rotom burns two things, and that's it. All right. Um, so they have Hail plus Curum, or Snow plus Curum. They have Glamora. This is looking a little scary. We have Whirlwind. Superior could be kind of nice to, like, sub-glare stuff. Rocks could also be pretty nice, but we have no way to prevent them from spinning. Would they lead Glamora, or would they lead Ninetales? So I'm thinking, like, if we can set up with Latias, Latias could win. But we need quite a few boosts. And we also... Oh, wait, we could... We actually do have speed uh, nine tails. And our defense boost maybe could be relevant on Zamazenta. Yeah, there's, like, plenty of things they could lead with that we wouldn't want to stay in on necessarily. So maybe we lead, like, Superior. Or just lead Latias. Let's just leave Latias. Okay, they leave with this. We could tear a poison, call mine right away. Um, tear a poison, call mine right away. Is that the, the play? How many boosts do we need to KO to Oko Nine Tails? We go plus one. Plus one. Okay, we need three boosts, it looks like. Well, I mean, I'm just going to go for it. Call mine, tear poison. Let's see, do they mortal spin right away? Let's do that. All right, we'll call mine again. I know Meowth could be like, Garfed and Trick. If they go into it, then we know. Like, right away. Um, is it worth just killing this? If they go for Trick, then we will be able to store power them. 
Or I just switch into maybe Rotom? Hmm. Should I give him Ting Lu? I don't think Ting Lu needs its thing. They would knock off of anything. And they do knock off. Okay, so maybe they're choice banded. Okay, I'm going to... I think I'm going to get up rocks. Or actually... Or Ruination. Okay, they're not choice banded. I'm a little surprised they just went into this. I think this maybe is the only thing they could have done, I guess. Bloody House could have set up on them otherwise. Okay. Should I get up rocks now? Sure. And let this die. Three hits, that's alright. Okay. Um... Galadias now? I don't know how much we take from knockoff from Meowskarada. Let's see. Utility pivot knockoff as a poison type. Or I could go Rotom and Will-O-Wisp. I'll go Rotom. I'm gonna click Will-O-Wisp. Hmm. Maybe they go Gouging Fire, but hopefully they go Ninetales or Glamora. Cool. So then we can go Tentacruel. Power Gem. Okay. Um, spin or just flip turn. Honestly, I could just see him flip turning. And then we can go uh, Zamazenta and actually kill this. Click Heavy Slam. Oh, wait, can Close Combat kill actually? Zamazenta to Ninetales. No. Alright, so we have to Heavy Slam. They're gonna go Gouging Fire now. Nothing else really wants to come in. Primarina. Would they start Calm Mining with this? They go for the Fairy move, the Water move? Let's just go Latias, I think. See what happens. Ooh, that's pretty cool. Okay, so they have that. Hmm. I think I'm gonna go Tentacruel, absorb the T-Spike, then we can use Superior if we want. And go from there. Do we wanna spin? I think spin could be kinda nice to get rid of the stuff for Latias. Then we can go for Jab or Knock. I think let's just get damage on it. Yeah, jab's nice into this. And we get a poison? Yeah, I think we just jab again. Nice. Okay. And then maybe we could go superior and get a boost. They although they could be physical on Kuram. But we don't need superior to win, so. I think we just go with this, get a boost. I could click sub. You can click leaf storm. Got rid of their hazards. This is the thing I think typing wise that might have been the most difficult. This or gouging fire. Because Zamazenta can now hit everything pretty good. Latias. If I if I stayed in versus the Meow Scrot, I we could have probably just won. I thought it was Scarfed and they were gonna trick. That's why they brought it out. Um Superior can get a boost now and then maybe paralyze something. If they go uh Meow Scrot, would just go Rotom. Oh, they go right into this. I think this, we just glare it. I think we have to just do that.
Okay. And they're going to start boosting. So I can go for sub and then Terra Blast. Or just click Terra Blast. And try and put them in range of stuff. They need like two more speed boost to outspeed stuff. So let's see. Superior to Gouging Fire. A plus two. And we're not going to do it KO yet. I could just go for sub. But if they have skill shot, you know. Cool. At this point, I think maybe we... I will just Terra Blast twice. Cool. Alright. Then we can go... Zamazenta and go for... Crunch? Or, I mean, uh, Close Combat? Wait, would Heavy Slam kill? Let's see. Heavy Slam, Summons Enter for Scouting Fire. Oh, we don't do anything. Okay, we'll close combat then. So Nine Tails can take one of these. Yeah. I think maybe we go... Could go Latias and try and heal. Let's go Latias. Oh, they doubled. I did not expect that. They do doubled and sacked for Marina. Okay. I expected maybe Veil there. Um, I think we lose our left. We'll lose the leftovers. That's okay. And we'll recover. And then we will recover again. And we'll call mind. Okay, so they have to encore here. And they have not terraed yet. Okay, they have to encore here. Latias. I don't think we're going to do very much with stored power. We could go for it to get damage on them. I think we do, because then they're in range of Samazenta. Now they're in range of close combat. Um, stored power again or go Meow yeah, Squad. I think we just stored power again. All right, they get up the Veil. So Aurora Veil, Encore. They could have Hypnosis. I think I go Rotom. Okay, they do have Hypnosis. Cool. Then we'll go Latias again. And... Curum behind the Veil. Zamazenta, Curum. They haven't terra yet. Oh, we're gonna need... Maybe I should have stayed in there and then gone Brotom and will o -Wisped. Oh, I should have thought of that, maybe. maybe although, if this is sub... I'm still in a bad spot. Okay, they're a Dragon Dance. Close Combat does the most. I think I have to crit. Should I... Should I Stone Edge then? I have a higher crit chance. Oh! Oh, and they're loaded dice anyways. Damn. Yeah, I think we just lose to this. This is tricky. I, what should I have done differently? Probably. Oh, kept the Rotom, but they're Terra Fire. <laughs> this is a cool, cool, uh, cool team. GGS. Maybe I should have led with Zamazenta that one and just try to be more aggressive with it. I don't know if people really worry about using the up the defense boost. I don't really I haven't really used Zamazenta outside of its iron defense set very much. Okay, they have a very, very bulky team. But I think we have ways to beat it. We have the Latias. Um which I think the only way to beat that is with Haze, since we can tear a poison. Um I think maybe we lead Superior. 
and just sub. And then we'll leaf storm. Okay. Um, do we need to Terra? Or just leaf storm? Should do a KO. Okay, and we'll glare this. <laughs> Haze. Okay. Is it worth tearing? It sounds fun, but it might not be the right decision. We're gonna run out of PP. Yeah, we're gonna run out of PP. How much should we do? We had 27. That's a decent chunk. Okay, we miss. Excuse me. Can we beat Cloudsire if it's unaware with this? Cloudsire. It's probably unaware. It's probably unaware. Yeah. Um, all right, we'll just go Tentacruel. And then we'll, I think we flip turn. Uh, I will knock off. Hopefully they don't go Gliscor. Okay, they go Gliscor. Then we'll flip turn. Yeah, flip turn. Really don't want to get poisoned on stuff, but... Okay, I have to let something get poisoned now, potentially. Um, Rotom, Tinglu. Maybe Tinglu. Let's see, what do they do? Yep, they just toxic. All right. Um. I could double right into Latias. And then Terra Poison with it so I don't have to let other things get toxic. Mm, I'm gonna get up rocks. What can they knock? Okay. I'll click Ruination. They have spikes. Okay, knocks it. Knock toxic protect spikes. Okay. Now I'm gonna go Latias. Now we're gonna tear poison recover. Okay. Um should I just start call minding? I don't know if that'll do it. Tox spec is poison though. Yeah, I think, uh, I don't think this can do anything to us. Does this get Haze too? Oh, it gets Yohan. Okay. Hmm. Good to know. So how much would a plus one would have done to this? Maybe I should... All right, next time, I'll call mine once and then just stored power this. Stored power now, they probably go blissy. And we won't do very much. Yeah, we'll go tentacruel. Maybe we got couching fire. And their boots. Or knock. Okay. I think we'll flip turn this time. Latias. Call mines. We'll store power the one time in the Cloud's Eye this time. Okay, let's see how much it does. Hopefully it does like half. Although they have unaware, so it's literally just the 60 base power coming off of our Spatak. That's not great. Oh, they tear a fairy. Okay. Hmm... Superior could still be pretty good. Tentacruel now basically has no recovery because of the burning bulwark. Whatever. Maybe we could just set up with this and still win. I mean, they have... Oh, they have Dragon Tail probably and Gouging Fire, right? So they'll phase us after they sleep us. Unless we uh, happen to wake up. I don't know. Let's try it. I'm gonna just keep calm mining here. 
Let's see, they must have Dragon Tail. Oh, they have uh, this, my bad, okay. So we can wake up here. Oh, we can still do it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Um, yep, we're just gonna do that. Then I think we stored power in case they go like gouging fire, maybe. Okay, they go blissy. So they're, now they're gonna boost with this. Now they're just gonna toss. Okay. Oh, they could have Thunder Wave. Yeah, they could have Thunder Wave. Seismic Toss. Thunder Wave would be... Wait, no, they wouldn't Thunder Wave us. Then they then they really put themselves in a bad spot. Okay, we'll just recover. Alright, how many boosts do we need? If they have Seismic Toss, they probably don't have Shadow Ball, right? I'm just gonna boost. Okay. I think we just boost all the way up. I could Aura Sphere, throw off an Aura Sphere as they go Blissey. Oh, I forgot. Uh, I should have actually Aura Sphere before. Did I actually attack Blissey with Sword Power yet? No. No, no, no. Okay, okay. Um, I think we're okay. We call Mind. Yeah. I think we definitely win with this. Or if you probably does more than sword power, right? Let's see. Latias plus six. Plus six to Blissey. Okay, sword power does more. Okay. Or wake. Um, I'm gonna just sword power now. And I think we win. Let's go, Latias. I think Draining Kiss would be fun to try out, but. Store power plus aura sphere, you know, has pretty much perfect coverage. They didn't have a dark type in that game, but store power is just insane. Okay, uh, so they have an offensive team, but they have like a the slow king to slow pivot. I could see leading Zamazenta or leading Superior. I think we'll lead Zamazenta. They lead with Great Tusk. Um. I'll go Rotom. Okay, they have rocks. I think I'm just gonna Volt Switch. I mean, I could attack into the Cerule Edge, but if they're Flash Fire, that doesn't sound fun. So. Okay. Then we can go Zamazenta. We'll go for Crunch. See what Great Tusk has. Okay. So it's not Helmet, not Leftovers. It's probably Boots, I guess. Or maybe it's Lumberry. Um, I think Latias could win. We're going to have to then deal with getting paralyzed by Superior and Roaring Moon, though. Well, uh, wait, if we could maybe deal with Roaring Moon, then Latias could win. We'll go... I'll go Rotom again. I'm gonna knock. Okay. I'm a Will O Wisp this time. Cool beans. Then we will Pain Split or Bolt Switch. Let's go on Pain Split. They've got a lot of HP. Nice. And now we could Bolt Switch or we could Overheat and kill him. They are flash fire. All right. We can get a slow bolt, probably. <laughs> All right. They have no, we have no item, so we can't be done hit by that. We could go Tentacruel and maybe kill him. Tentacruel, Cerule Edge. Knock off will kill him. That's if there's no HP. Or we go Zamazenta. Um, 
I don't want to lose a Pokemon here, so we'll go Zamazenta. So they have to Terra if they don't want to die 100%. Cool. They go Roaring Moon and set up now. Keldo. All right, we go Tentacruel. Tentacruel is so nice in the Keldeo. It's nice being able to like have this matchup. Okay, they go Roaring Moon. Um, I think we flip turn into Rotom. Or maybe we rapid spin actually. So then we can stay. Hmm. Actually, maybe Terra Fairy would be better on Rotom because it's not going to resist dark. No, we'll go Ting Lu. We'll flip turn in Ting Lu maybe. Because uh, Ting Lu won't die to anything. And we can just get him out of here. Um, And we have Latias still for Keldeo, so. What the hell? How are we faster? They go for Dragon Tail? They went for knockoff. Okay, I'm just gonna whirlwind. Okay. Then we'll get up rocks or earthquake and just do a lot of damage. Go for earthquake. Go superior. Okay. They're gonna leave storm, right? Could go into our own, could go into Rotom. Actually, I don't even think Leaf Storm kills us. Ting Lu from Superior. Yeah, we, mm, we might die. I'm just click Whirlwind. Okay, we do die. Then we can go Zamazenta and kill him, right? Yeah, we'll go Zamazenta. We'll click close combat. Oh, all right. That's low king, so that's what I expected to come out there. Are they scarfed? Go tentacle again, just in case they're scarfed. What? They have to be specs to do that much damage to tentacle, right? Keldeo specs. Yeah, they're specs. All right. Well. Does Amazon to kill them? With a little damage, we would have killed them. So I think we just flip turn. All right. This comes in. Um, we could go Superior and Glare, Rotom and Wisp. They haven't Terrid, right? I think we go Superior and Glare just to ensure that we like have a better time into this. Now Latias will outspeed them. All right, now we get to fuck around with Paras and Sub, I think. Or we could go Latias and Calm Mind. Or we go Tentacruel and Rapid Spin. I'll go Tentacruel and Rapid Spin. So they got the future side up. Chili. Roaring Moon. I think I... Jab and knock them out. I think Rotom could take a hit. Or uh, uh, not knock them out. Just jab and weaken them and we sack this. Okay. Then we can go Rotom and Will-O-Wisp. We got rid of the rock, so Rotom wouldn't take, uh, it would come in at not 60%. Okay, they go Great Tusk now. I think we can go Latias and win. Latias, Terra Poison, Calm Mind. Go 
command again command again mm, yeah command again Chili, Kevrowing Moon, New Aura Sphere. Oh yeah, we we knew we were gonna be faster. My bad. Let's go, Ladias wins it again. I totally forgot we were faster with uh, what, Tentacruel? Yeah, I don't know how much. So they were really bulky. All right, I think this will be the last one. I like Sup Superior basically, but from what I've been playing it so far. I try and it's it's not as much of a sweeper, but it, it can actually like do a lot of supporting with glare and leaf storm. Like it makes people switch around, they're scared of it, you know? And it's been helping set up a lot for Latias. And then Zamazenta can deal with like weakened stuff for Latias. Or vice versa, kind of. <clears throat> Zamazenta and Latias definitely are like the most threatening guys, and then everybody else kind of feels like it's support. Alright, so they have offense. Um we probably died to Tenic or uh, Tenicor probably dies to Deoxys, but I still want to like lead Ink, or we could lead Rotom and Volt Switch, or we could just lead Ting Lu. Ting Lu actually seems pretty good. Lead Deoxys Speed. Okay, I'm gonna get a Brox if I can. If they want to taunt, that's fine. I think. There may be screens on this. No more earthquake. Alright, we crit him. That's pretty nice. They have screens too. Okay. I think maybe we switch here. And just go Tenic Roll. We can just spin. Um... Double knock. Whoops. I should have spun again, damn it. More slower than that. Alright, is Boulder coming out now? Boulder will be faster still. Oh, they go Latias. Hmm. I kind of want to spin and flip turn. I don't think they're gonna kill us here if they even if they do attack. Then we can go Ting Lu and Whirlwind. Um Yeah, we can just whirlwind. Yep. Take that pretty easily. Okay. Then we'll go. We we'll go Tentacruel or we could go Rotom. Tentacruel actually is pretty nice, like it can remove items, so. Rotom couldn't even burn this, so. And it's really scared of, I guess, Tentacruel is pretty scared of Iron Boulder coming in too. You go Latias again. I'll just knock. It has Call Mine Agility. Stored Power. Just go Tinglu. Call Mine again. Whirlwind. Okay, in comes this this time. Okay, we need to... Get ready to beat that Latias, because this thing's almost dead. And this is now in. This is really scary. I think maybe I just ruin Nation. Okay. Is that Specs damage? Who knows? Let's see. Tinglu, Darkrai. Maybe it's Scarfed. I think it would be choiced. Focus Blast to Ting Lu. They're not even max special attack. Focus Blast did 33. Well, that's Life Orb. Okay, just kidding. They're max special attack. Maybe they're Scarfed. We'll go Tentacruel. Okay, we get this bit after drop. We'll go for... A flip turn. Okay, they go lot of ass cool beans. I think we go Zamazenta and does that kill? 
Latias, Nat Dex, Calm Mind. Say they're Terra Poison. Heavy Sam will kill. Okay. All right, cool beans. Dark ride, they are scarfed. Okay, we'll give them Ting Lu. All right, and we're still alive. We can just get off an earthquake here. Kill Sin Race, please. Let's go. The team is working. All right, this. This is probably Dragon Dance, right? This is probably Dragon Dance. Are I just Whirlwinds? Or Ruination? Click Ruination. Oh, maybe they're Choice Banded. If you turn. All right, Dark Rai. I think we go Tentacruel again. And we'll just go for... Poison jab, maybe? Knock off. Poison jab could poison either of those, but it is resisted by both, right? Knock off will remove an item, but if they trick me, then I'm not even going to kill them. I will go for knock off. Okay, that's pretty good. They were banded. Um, flip turn again. They could have been adamant too. Could go Rotom here. We still have our Terra. Rotom could Terra steal and burn the boulder. Knockoff will 2 it KO this, but we're going to be 2 it KO'd. And we just knock. And then... Could go Superior and Leaf Storm or Latias. Superior, can you kill this? Dragapult. Okay, Superior will kill it. Oh, they can. Okay, they did that. Okay. So in comes Dragapult again. So we're dead to, dead to dragon darts, right? We don't need this then. We could go Zamazenta. They tear it already, okay. So yeah, we could go Zamazenta and, and just crunch. It doesn't let them set up with anything. This is gonna outspeed us, but as long as they can't boost, I think Rotom. Oh, nice! And they and they go for it. Let's go! Really fun balance team. I like all these guys are fun to use. The team seems to be functioning all right. The whirlwind is really nice versus all of the setup with the screens, especially. Tentacruel was really nice. It was a really good pivot. Um, I don't, I don't know if putting this a little bit in defense, but you just go the HP and then the speed. Um, and then the fence is to give you know like a little bit of bulk on the physical side since you only have 65, but. Rotom was nice that first game. It was a really fun team. If you're interested in trying it out, I'll put a pokey paste in the description. I don't know if there's anything I'd even change, but I'm, I'm excited to try out some more new things. So I'm going to end it here. Thanks for watching, and I hope you have a good rest of your day and have fun playing uh, the DLC. Peace.